I, I know we had heat a while ago, and we haven't seen temperatures that warm, but man, fall seems to be just around the corner with what we're seeing out there. And as far as temperatures go across the map, we're all sitting pretty cool. Mid to upper 60s if you're off to the northwest, otherwise looking at low 70s across a good portion of the state. What's making this feel even cooler are the winds that we've got screaming out there. We looked at gusts earlier. Those are in the upper 20s to low 30s. Actual sustained winds sitting in the upper teens to low 20s. So very strong winds out there. Not seeing too many kites or toupees flying around out there, thankfully. Uh, we'll eventually be seeing this wind die down as we head later in the day tomorrow, but it'll be with us until then. 73 right now. Again, dew point is woefully low, so dry air is at play here, and that's going to help us drop off by way of temperature. 51 degrees by 7 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. We keep those skies clear all throughout the night, all throughout the day, as we warm it back up to 75 degrees. So still below average, but at least we get a really sunny day out there for us. We did see that rain yesterday. That system now pushing its way off to the east, kind of stagnating at least the center of that low up in northern portions of Minnesota. What this has been doing for us is directing those winds out of the northwest. And you can see these black lines here, lines of constant pressure. When those get closer together, we see those winds stay strong. So if this little guy can stick up there for a little bit longer, which I do think he will, that's going to keep those winds fairly strong for us and keep that colder, drier flow of air alive. High pressure is going to try to keep us sunny for a bit here, and I do think it will do exactly that as it hangs out just off to the southwest of the state. So we've got sunshine for a while here. Could see a few clouds wrapping into eastern portions of the state still on the back side of that low. Otherwise, just a beautiful one out there for us as we put together a really nice day and evening. So 50 is what we'll be dropping it down to tonight. Keep those winds out of the west at 10 to 20 miles an hour. So hanging on to the gusty one out there. And tomorrow we continue that as well. Temperature climbs up to 75 degrees. So breezy, but with the sun that we've got out there and the drier air in the mix, it's looking to be a beautiful day. Uh, you see, starting to drag in a little bit more warmth for us here. So we'll inch up as we head into the middle of the work week. But it's going to stay cool for a bit, especially the mornings. Low to mid-50s over the next few days. We make it into the upper 70s Tuesday and Wednesday after that finally notch an 80 under our belt. But we're right back down into the mid-70s on Friday with your next chance for showers and thunderstorms. Over the next eight days, though, that's all we've got. Temperatures back into the mid-80s by the weekend.